The News 5 original sidewalks with big gaps right in the middle of downtown Cleveland. This one is on Superior Avenue, just west of Public Square. Before the All-Star Game, we did ask why nothing was being done, even though the walkways have been crumbling for years. Kevin Barry learned the city took action after we asked those questions. The holes in the sidewalk along West Superior are so big you can easily fit your feet inside or a trip as you walk down the sidewalk. We asked the city earlier this summer what's being done to fix these crumbling sidewalks and we got their reply. Their only record of it are these citations and inspections done after we first told you about the holes. It would be easily get flipped. Jerry Ward's back problems keep him in a wheelchair. This stretch of sidewalk along West Superior makes it hard for him to catch the bus. You got to duck these holes or they'll flip a, a power chair or a manual chair that I'm in. Michael says he's run his hot dog stand along Superior for the last nine years, and he's been complaining about the sidewalk for just about as long. But he says nothing has changed. This should have been fixed about five, six years ago, to be honest with you. Except we now know a few days after our first story aired, the city did inspect the patch of sidewalk on Superior we were asking about. These citations say about $110,000 worth of work has to be done. City code says the parking lot owner is on the hook and has 30 days to appeal or contact the city to plan out repairs. The lot owner told us before they think the city should be responsible for maintaining these sidewalks and they plan to appeal these citations. In Cleveland, I'm Kevin Barry, News 5. We checked in with the other cities in the area. Everyone we spoke to also says it's their policy to have property owners pay for sidewalk repairs so long as the city didn't cause that damage. All right, John, how are we looking out there?